Hello, nice to meet you again, and welcome to Get News of Gento Radio and Television Station. And now today's slide. Leaders of Gento City will direct sellers at all levels and localities after TED to speed up the implementation of projects and tests, especially promoting and calling for investment and implementing big projects for early completion for social economic indicators and diversion progress for 2020 to 2025. The Ministry of Health informed that the total number of patients being treated after the three-day holiday of Lunar New Year is 109,840. Physicians performed 7,291 emergency surgeries, welcoming 7,680 babies born. A Western board created many models with houses and boats on the river. In the context of the general economic recession of the work and the home country, Gunter's social economic development in January still recorded positive signs of growth. Leaders of Gunter City People's Committee said that the city will direct sectors set on levels and localities after that to speed up the implementation of projects and tasks, especially promoting and calling for investment and implementing big projects for early completion for social economic indicators and divergent progress of 2020-2025 time. According to Gangta Department of Planning and Investment, in January 2024, the total retail sales of goods and service revenue of the entire city is estimated to reach 10,938 billion Vietnamese stone, An increase of 10.26 percent year on year. Export turnover of goods and services earning foreign exchange is estimated at 186 million dollars, a 5.15 percent over the same period last year. Even during the 2024 Lunar New Year, the city is still determined to focus on promoting production and business to proactively source goods for TED. At the same time, many activities are organized for people to enjoy spring and celebrate TED. Regarding the city's general development goals, the city continues to cut and simplify unnecessary and unreasonable administrative procedures and business conditions, increasing compliance costs for people and businesses, improving the business environment, and enhancing competitiveness. At once, promote the role of special working group to remove difficulties and obstacles, and support business and investors in the city. The Ministry of Health informed that the total number of patients being treated after the three-day holiday of Lunar New Year is 109,840 cases, an increase of 14.7 percent compared to the same period of 2023. Physicians performed 7,291 emergency surgeries, welcoming 7,618 newborns. According to the Ministry of Health report on medical work during the Lunar New Year, as of noon on February 11, the second day of the Lunar New Year, the total number of patients currently being treated at medical facilities nationwide is 92,742 patients. All medical examination and treatment facilities have fully organized four levels. Performing examination and emergency care for 33,185 patients, an increase of 8.1 percent. 19,269 patients, of which were hospitalized for inpatient treatment, down 2.1 percent compared to the same day of 2023. Every year, when everyone gathers and reunites with their families to celebrate Spring and New Year, Mr. Võ Văn Khánh continues with his daily work, protecting and cleaning the place of worship at Bình Thủy Community House. For the past five years, maintaining order, protecting cultural heritage, taking care of incense sticks, and serving visitors at the historical relic site of Bantui Communal House has become a familiar job for Mr. Võ Văn Khánh even during dead days. For him, this is considered a joy because he has contributed his part to protecting and preserving the cultural heritage of his homeland. 
Besides protecting and preserving the communal house, Mr. Khan also promotes unique artistic architecture to Vista, contributing to preserving and promoting the value of historical and cultural relics here. The West is closely associated with rivers, and the image of riverside houses is no longer strange to people. But for those far from home, this image evokes many memories. That's why a Western boy created many models with houses and boats on the river. These are Western house models with river features, houses, boats of young men Võ Văn Khan living in Thành Phố District, Bến Tre. In 2021, the COVID-19 pandemic spread to the Western provinces. Since then, Khan stayed at home to try making house models and was fortunate to be loved by many people. Vietnamese people living in the U.S., Australia, Taiwan, and Malaysia look for Khan's models to decorate a house, reliving memories of their homeland through miniature space. The work depicts a scene of daily life and labor of Westerners, it took the guy a year to complete, and it cost 30 million Vietnamese dong. Kenta Department of Transport informed that during the 2024 Lunar New Year, the number of people traveling by public transport such as buses and taxis increased. Accordingly, from February 8 to the present, Phương Trang Bus joins the company transporting over 11,000 passengers, an increase of 37% over the same period. The most popular routes are from the inner city to Karang Omoman Ventan districts and routes boarding Hậu Giang and Kiên Giang. During that, the whole city had nearly 10,000 passengers traveling by taxi with over 3,000 viral chips a which nearly five reaches which 1,700 people traveling by electric taxi. Rises remain stable as usual. Known as the second largest rice cultivation area in the city, in recent years, Kandar District has undergone a significant transformation in crop and livestock structure, contributing to the increased value of agricultural products for the residents. Notably, the adoption of high-tech agricultural production models had paved the way for a new direction and opened up promoting prospects for the local agricultural sector. One such model is the cultivation of a 6,000 square meters needed melon farm located in Trung Thanh Khmun, Kado District. Although recently introduced, this farm with its investment in a farm oriented abroad has marked a bright road for Trung Thanh Khmun and in turn, Kado District is home. According to Mr. Duong Văn Nhu, the owner of the farm with an average of 1,000 square meters of needed melon production, the yield is approximately four Considering the current market price fluctuating around or below 40,000 dong per kilogram after deducting expenses, this model generates a considerable profit. The efficiency is relatively good compared to rice or other crops, and the crop is also faster. One year can produce from four to five crops. He is the rice of the Ting Yung Agricultural Cooperative in Thanh Phu Kamun Kodo District. In the winter spring crop of 2023-2024, the cooperative has been supported with 24 water-level monitoring sensors in the fields. This not only enhances the cultivation capabilities of farmers, but also contributes to reducing greenhouse gas emissions in the agricultural production. Besides the cooperative, the local authorities in Kodo District have have installed an additional 20 centers in some fields of Thanh Phu Khmun. Whether we go to the farm or not, we will know how high and low the water level is in the farm. We will notify you via our phone to know the water level in the farm. People can use the application to adjust some experience one to five to reduce. From there, it is possible to adjust the necessary and sufficient water conditions for their farm. Kadao District currently boasts approximately 21,500 hectares of rice fields, 1,200 hectares of vegetables, and 5,000 hectares of fruit orchards. As of now, the entire district has 12 alka products, rising 3 to 4 stars, with the majority being agricultural products, despite rice being the primary crop in recent years. 
Gado district has witnessed the emergence of various high-tech agricultural models. This not only contributes to increase in the value of communities, but also opens up new prospects for the district's agricultural sector. In general, the implementation of the high-tech agricultural model in Gerda area today has brought high efficiency. The product output price is also more stable compared to using normal inorganic fertilizers. Alongside this, the locality is expanding high economic agricultural production models, gradually forming large specialized cultivation areas. An assembly illustration is the area specializing in fresh trees covering over 2,000 hectares in Tengkermun. These are considered flexible, effective, and sustainable steps for a suburban district that has been built upon its agricultural strength. And now a quick check on water condition. Thank you very much for your attention. Please visit us on website, gantv.vn. Bye for now.